It kind of looks like a blue granola bar in the picture. Uh, what is going on guys? Andy Gabs back for another video and I know you guys think I'm in Japan right now. Like technically in the videos I am still in Japan, but we had to come home a week early So there is still a part two and part three of the Tokyo videos But I figured I would give you guys like a little treat in between and I kind of want to make you guys wait a little bit because the next video uh, Has the owl forest in it, which was probably my favorite part of Japan my favorite part of this trip But I brought a bunch of stuff home with me as you can see on the table some of it I have had before but some of it, like this, I have absolutely no idea what that is. Um, so we're gonna have to wait for these two. Like we'll try everything else, then I'm, I gotta cook those two or like figure out how to cook them. Me and Kelsey are just gonna try everything. She actually agreed to like be in a video. Like in in a video. I've you been in like three. Yeah, but not like in in. Okay, three out of, this is a video 84. Listen, I'm expensive. Also, sorry, I know I kind of look like a bum. I just got done changing my car's oil and me and the oil filter got in a little bit of a fight for about two hours. It was rough. Yeah. And if you hear Scarlett, she's right over there. She's probably gonna make some noises during this video, so I apologize for that. But let's uh, let's get this started. What do you wanna try first? Okay, we'll try this. So some of the stuff does have like an English-ish name. So this says matcha marshmallow chocolate. I'll give you guys a little look at that real quick. Um, basically, it's like these little green it almost looks like wheat. That's what I, yeah. It looks like, uh, what are those called? Moon rocks? Space rocks? It's like... No, oh, it looks... Weed fuzzy. rolled in weed, and then... It looks really fuzzy, but it's not. Don't do drugs. Drugs are bad. I mean, it's not a drug. But whatever. Yeah, so matcha marshmallow chocolate. I think if you like all this stuff, it's good. I don't know. It's weird. Like, I can't imagine someone being like, Hey babe, can you go to 7-Eleven and get me some matcha marshmallow chocolates? You were craving marshmallows yesterday. Yeah, okay, I love marshmallows, but I don't like these. I don't think they're bad. I don't know, that wasn't bad, but I left a really weird aftertaste in my mouth. But you know what gets a great aftertaste out? Pepsi. Whatever this is. So this was in the refrigerated section of 7-Eleven. All it says is VAAM 1800 milligram. So it might be an energy thing, and there's also a picture of a hornet, or a bee. I don't know if you guys can see that, right there. Very small. Um, so from my experience, this is gonna be some sort of like jello-y liquid. It's like a jello or a jelly in a pouch. Let me go first. I don't want to go first. I'm, I'm not gonna make a face. I'm not gonna face. I'm not gonna make a face. I like that. Ew. It's like Sprite Jello. It's like a weird texture. It's like eggs going in your mouth. It's like Jello. Jello. But it's like all broken up. It's only got 32 calories for the pack. Yeah, I like it. It tastes. It's like Sprite or like orange juice maybe. Lemonade. Mmm. I think it's like lemonade Kool Aid, but with jelly in it. I usually like the jelly stuff because they have these that are like apple, orange, strawberry. And it's just like jelly powder. Which dog is that? That's Kai, because he just took my toes. Yep, <laughs> Kai is underneath the table licking my foot. Um, okay, so for the VAM, I don't know, I like it. If any Japanese people watch this video, tell me what that is. VAM, again. I don't know, I thought it was good though. Here's Kai making a guest appearance. Stop, try and get whatever's on the table. Oh. I don't know, I think you guys can see Klaus right there too, yep. While we're trying drinks, this one is called Chocola BB Hyper, and it's got a heart on it. 13 active ingredients combination. That's the only English words on it. It says B2, B6, so I'm assuming vitamin B2, B6. Um, but aside from that, everything else is in Japanese. So, Me too. All right, Kelsey's gonna try this one first. Like Coke? No, no, don't, don't smell it. Just go ahead and go, just go ahead and take a drink. Just go ahead, drink, just drink. Sip, decent size sip. It's not bad. It smells gross. No. That's you, dum dum. It smells like what it tastes like. Taste it. Mm -mm. I don't like that at all. That's disgusting. Um, tastes like berries. Tastes like booty hole. I feel like this is like that 
<laughs> that plum wine you thought you got? I feel like that's what this no, one tastes like. No, plum wine tastes so much okay, better Okay, but I'm that. saying this one, I think it was. Mm -hmm. I've never been to Japan because no one has ever taken me. That's gross. I did not like BB, BB Hyper. I really want to know if these taste like Funyun. Okay, so these is uh, some sort of chip or chips. So they look like Funyuns. This has no English aside from snack. They look like Funyuns though, or like mini Funyuns. Let's not smell it. Not smell it. They kind of look cheesy. I don't know if you guys can tell. Don't smell it. Just pop it in your mouth. Three, two, one, go. These are good. Oh, these are good. Cheetos. Yeah, it's like a puff Cheeto, but. Not as cheesy. Yeah, I don't know. How's it good? I could definitely eat these. Okay, I'm keeping American 7 Eleven. Can you, uh,. Make something happen here. It oh, nice. I didn't mention too. If you've never been to Japan, Japanese 7 Eleven is not like American 7 Eleven. Like, I just spit. The food is really good. Like, you can get like actual meals that they heat up there for you. They have like actual fryers where they make fried food. Uh, like, the food is actually tasty at Japanese 7 Eleven. Not like American 7 Eleven where it sucks. All right, let's go with this. This is like some weird. German. I, it's like, no, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's German. It's called Baumkuchen. B-A-U-M-K-U-C-H-E-N. It's like a bunch of different layers of dough. They say it looks like tree rings. Um, so I don't know if it's flavored or if it's just like sweet dough. Um, but I thought it looked cool. That's why I bought it. Yeah, I mean, it, to me, it just looks like dough. I, don't know, I think you guys can see pretty good. I'll try to zoom in on that. Does it um, feel apart? No. No, just take Kinda. it back. No, just take it back. The whole I am gonna take a bite. Whole thing. Three, two, one. Yeah. This is like sponge cake. Yeah. That's what it feels like. Yummy. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't say it's overly good or overly bad. It doesn't really have a taste. Yeah, it's kind of eggy, like that eggy dough or eggy bread, like brioche. That's what it tastes like. It tastes like brioche. Okay, let's do these because I've never had these. I don't think I've ever even you read seen my mind. these. I was literally just looking at that. So it's got a picture of mint chocolate chip ice cream, and it says crispy mint chocolates. It kind of looks like a blue granola bar. Definitely smells minty. So it almost looks like a pizza. Like it's got little slices as I'm like dropping little pieces. The dogs will eat that. And those are either. So yeah, it looks like blue oats. Definitely smells super minty, like almost toothpaste minty. Yeah. So. I don't. Oh. I like the texture. It's like um, corn flakes. Not like a granola. Yeah, it's definitely not granola-y, which is weird because it looks like granola. But, mm. there's Scarlet talking. Um, Save this one for later. I don't know, I feel like it's like, it's familiar. Rice Krispie kind of texture? Yeah, maybe like Rice Krispies with like Chocolate. mint frosting. Like frosting holding the Rice Krispie treats together. You know what I mean? Mm, yeah. I don't know. I don't really like that one. I feel like I need milk after that, like a big glass of milk. Yeah. But I hate milk. Milk. Um, milk. Milk. People make fun of me for the way I say milk, cup, and house. Milk, cup, milk, milk, <laughs> milk, milk. Milk. How do you say it? Milk. Milk. I mean, I can't even speak English, so. Milk, and then people say I pronounce the cup, the p too much in cup. Cup. And house, house. They say I say Canadian house. They say I say Canadian. They say I say it like I'm Canadian, house. But I don't know if they're like chips, or if it's like actual chocolate. Chocolate. Um, there you go. Ooh, they look weird. Dig it, sink it. Oh. It tastes like cereal. Yeah, but what is that texture? Ooh, um, those wafer candies. Mm. I'm not candies, like the wafer cookies. You can get that's like wafers and frosting, and wafer and frosting, wafer frosting, like three times. So this does have some like actual chocolate on it, like right there. That's like actual chocolate. The wafer, you can get like the Neapolitan ones, where it's like pink, vanilla, and chocolate. Pink, vanilla, and chocolate. Strawberry, vanilla, and chocolate. That was good though. This is like, pancakes and they have butter and maple syrup in between them already like japan is innovating and that's only 100 yen yeah 100 yen that's less than a dollar 
for two pancakes with maple and butter. Actually, you know what? Screw it. We'll just eat this now. Well, technically it's four, but it's two uh... with, so like, let's get you guys a cross section real quick. Just show you this magical mix. What? Do you see that? So that's maple syrup and butter in between there. It's, I'm telling you, Japan is innovating right now. Hold on, let me break this one in half and get like a middle bite. Three, yeah. two, one. Yeah, it's so good. Yeah. It's literally like a really good pancake yeah. with maple syrup and butter in between it. Scarlett has feelings about this one. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. And like heat it up, they're better, but you don't need to heat them up, I don't think, for them to be good. Um, I need a sip though, let me have a sip back. I'm like, Parks, give me a sip. Peas? Please. <laughs> Peas, give me sippy. Peas. Peas, give me sippy. Uh, we'll try these. This just says rice crackers. They look like, um, you know those like rice things that you can get that are like yeah. that big, you can get them like barbecue flavored or whatever. That's what they look like to me. Yeah? That's pretty much what it tastes like. Yeah, but not good. I would say just like a more condensed version of those, but I like these. They're hard. Yeah. There's definitely a flavoring to them too. I don't like the flavor. Almost like an onion. Kind of like a funion flavor. I feel like you could do ASMR with those. I really want to stand up and just go chew one of these in the microphone. But this little spot that I have to get out right here, if I get out, I'll try to knock something, I'll, I'll knock something over. It won't be good. Just listen, everyone be quiet. No, you be quiet. Listen. I'm sure that was a sexy view. Five things left and then the two things that we have to cook are right here. Oh yeah, I gave some stuff to Noah too. Uh, bad choice Noah. Hopefully, we're gonna meet up soon. Tim and Brian keep playing with my heart. Brian, I know if you watch this video, stop playing with my, ooh. Yeah, that's why I'm this like. This is weird. I, I know the feeling, I can't think of it. This is almost, is it gum? Or is it gummy? Very honey dewy. Very honey dewy. Like, if I just gave you this and told you, you don't like it? <laughs> and told you that it was like dehydrated honeydew, it's like a gummy and gum texture. Yeah, but what? There's like a gummy. Oh, you know what the white part of gummies you get? Like if you get the shark gummies that are white and blue. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? Well, like the shark gummies, they're like blue on the top and then white on the bottom. You mean the shark? I hate these. I hate these like baby songs. They get stuck in my head. Yeah, I like these. She's kept everything else. I'm gonna keep these guys. No, no, you bring everything over here. I don't even want like Okay, uh, next up. Yeah, it looks like a french fry. Scarlett is being impressively good too. Can we get a comment down below for how good Scarlett's being? She hasn't freaked out. Uh, she's only talked a couple times. I think she enjoys Watch. Wow, these look like french fries. These are literally french fries. Wow. What? It these? feels like it. Okay, go. Class, go. Get these are 100%. What no, no, I'm giving you another one. Oh, okay. They're like french fries, but really hard. Like they yeah, these are like super crunchified french fries that aren't hot. I feel like we need ketchup. I can't get yeah, I was trying to get one. Okay. You guys see that? They look exactly like french fries. Klaus, go. They just like we left your french fry in a car for a week and you decided to eat it because you found it. You know what I mean? I feel like your brother would like these because they taste like sofa french fries. Yeah. <laughs> Her brother ate sofa nuggets once. Shout out Kyle. I think he fell asleep on them and then the next morning he was like, chicken nugget. You just ate it. Yeah. I feel like it's one of those things where you don't like it but you gotta keep eating it. That's gross. It tastes like I don't know, I also just licked my fingers. There's definitely still oil on my fingers. So this looks like chocolate filled strawberries. It's called Galbo. Again, Perfect. no English on this I one. Feel like but raspberry chocolate. Pretty sure that's Straw a strawberry. I wasn't looking, I didn't. Yeah. Ew. Mm. You would like that texture. So would a pregnant person. You know, I think chalk. 
I mean, I get some strawberry, but I don't know, texturally there's something there that I don't know what it is. And it's like fake strawberry and fake chocolate. Not like when you eat a chocolate covered strawberry, you want like that real chocolatey strawberry-ness. And that's not that. No. Um, so chili potato chips and then GABA. Oh, by the way, I just got this because my last name is Gabbard and it says GABA. Literally the only reason I saw that and I was like, ooh, I need that. Also no English on GABA. So 58 kcals. Um, that's what the back of most of these look like. It's literally just random Japanese words. But okay, let's try a GABA. I think they look like chocolate covered coffee beans. I think we should do no smell. Okay, that's what you say every time. Can you put your dog to go away? Close, get. Go lay down. Go. Go. T -t Today? I really, yeah, I can't get these open. It's a square, I thought it was a circle. Okay, let's see. Oh. Dark chocolate? Yeah, that's all it is. Can I Google what GABA means? Maybe that means. Oh. Yeah, I really think this is uh, just dark chocolate. Just like little dark chocolate nuggets. Last one. So this is chili potato chips. This is the last one before we get to the hot stuff. Also, 96% sure these are spicy. It looks like they're flames. No idea what this is. Don't know how to cook it either. We're gonna try to figure that out. All right. No. They don't smell super spicy. They don't smell like chili. It's kind of like barbecue. Ooh. That's an interesting flavor. Korean barbecue, maybe? I'm gonna go figure out how to cook both of these. I'll be right back. My eyes look super cool. Do you guys see that? It looks like neon scary vampire color. So, I made the meals to the best of my ability. Sorry, the table's probably not like even stuff, uh, but whatever. I made the meals to the best of my ability using the directions that were supplied to me, but everything was in milliliters and I don't know how long I was supposed to cook everything. So, first one is, these are like glass noodles, I think is what they're called, or rice noodles. They're like completely see-through, and it says this is Chinese. Smells pretty good, kind of fishy in a way. Yeah, there's there's some some mystery ingredient in it. Probs mushroom, but I don't know. So here you go. Can you try. Also, um, Scarlett has joined us. I don't know how to talk to. Her. So we're going with the uh, Chinese clear noodles first. You gotta get a bigger bite Andrew, than that. I can't chopstick. Freaking dig it in there and scoop a That's good old amazing. dunk out. Like, do you touch my steak? Garlic's watching me. Huh. The noodles are a weird texture. I feel like they don't really chew. Oh, yeah, no, it just like slid down my throat. Yeah. Wake up, cutie. You need to go, buddy. <laughs> yeah. It tastes good. It doesn't taste like whatever the weird. You know, I mean, taste-wise, it's, 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 poof, no. Fine, I'll do it. It's not bad. No? The flavor is, yeah, this is good. I don't know, try it. Try whatever that thing is I just yeah. ate. I don't know what that was, but it was very flavorful, kind of like, Fudge. <laughs> kind of like garlicky. Good. Um, I'm gonna take one more bite of this. Next up, this is the spicy cup of noodle. So I'll try some noodles and then I'll slurp up some juice. Obviously, probably not gonna be that spicy to me because I'm kind of a big deal. Um, yeah, let's try it. it. Tastes good. It tastes kind of like kimchi in a way. You know what kimchi is? You good? She's you want some spicy noodles? You want some spicy noodles? Do you? You think spicy noodles are funny? She's very smiley and giggly now. Um, I wouldn't say this is great. The weird noodles are better. Really? No, it's not that hot. I mean, there's a little bit of spice, but like for having flames on the, the jar and whatnot, I would expect spice here. Like, no, 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 here. Ew. Open your mouth. That was hot. Okay. It's hot. It's hot. You think so? Oh yeah. Okay, wait. You gotta sip the broth. Dude. No. Yes, you gotta sip the broth. Yeah, it's freaking hot. 
Yeah, but that's where all the goodness is, is in the broth. Yeah, tell it to the broth. See, don't be waiting. There is. Careful, it's on my face still. Is it on my face still, bruh? <laughs> all right, guys. Well, yeah. Um, that's pretty much it. Those weird noodles are delicious. And I feel like it was a mushroom that I ate, which I'm not okay with, that I liked it. Thank you very much for watching, I appreciate it. Go ahead, like the video for me if you wouldn't mind, it helps out the channel a lot. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and if you are subscribed, that means you like what you saw. If you like what you saw, hit the notification bell. It's right there, or there. Uh, can I help you? Right over here. Hit it, so that way you get notified every time I post. If you like what you see, you're gonna wanna see it when it comes out, you know what I'm saying? So hit the notification bell. Leave me a comment down below, tell me what you thought. Uh, after this video, get ready for part two, including the owl forest in Shibuya. Thank you guys again, I love you all. Peace. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave that in. <laughs> you never I'm do. I'm gonna leave that in. For sure. Oh, I just set my face on her. Alright, peace, guys.